Hello everyone. Welcome to Career Group. Today we'll be talking about the process of studying medicine in the US. For studying medicine in the US, you will first need to complete an undergraduate degree in the US before joining the medical school. This is called as the pre-med degree and can be in subject like biology or chemistry. Once you have completed the pre-med, you will need to write the MCAT, that is the medical college admission test, before you get into the medical school. An American medical program is generally for four years. MCAT assesses your abilities in problem solving, critical thinking, and your knowledge of natural, social, and behavioral concepts. Apart from MCAT, you may be expected to take TOEFL exam as you will be applying as an international student. TOEFL tests your proficiency in English. Additionally, you will need documents as per the university's requirement, but generally you may need to keep the documents like academic transcript, the SOP that is a statement of purpose, recommendation letters, or financial documents, and any specific documents that the university requires. The actual medical degree, which is of four years and called the MD, which will teach you about the basic sciences and you will also undergo clinical training under the supervision of health practitioners. Once you have finished the medical school, you have to complete residency which takes between 3 to 7 years and write the USMLE exam before being able to practice as a doctor. While you are doing your residency, you can also take up USMLE United States Medical License exam. The USMLE is compulsory for all doctors to obtain a license to practice a medicine in the US. The USMLE consists of three steps which assesses a physician's knowledge, concepts and principles. The USMLE results are sent to the medical board so the initial medical license can be granted. USMLE is a multiple choice exam and tests how well you have understood and apply basic medical concepts to the clinical scenarios. This is the step one of USMLE. The step two exam is in two parts. The first part is a clinical knowledge is a multiple choice exam and tests if you have the necessary medical and clinical knowledge. The second part clinical skills is more of practical exams and tests if you can gather information from standardized patients, perform a physical examination, communicate the findings to the patients and write the patient note. Step 3 is once again a multiple choice exam. This exam assesses the examinee's ability to apply medical knowledge and the understanding of biomedical and clinical science necessary for the unsupervised practice of medicine with emphasis on patient management in ambulatory settings. The information provided in our today's episode will be helpful for you while you are planning to study medicine in the US. Hope you have liked our today's episode. Do not forget to subscribe on Career Growth and share with others. Thank you.